In this video, we're going to be working on individual integral. I'm going to take a look at the integral of x to the fourth over 1 plus x squared dx. Now, the fact that this is a rational expression, probably the easiest, most straightforward approach would be to take this, do some long division, come up with an equivalent expression that is going to integrate a whole lot easier. So we're going to have an x to the fourth on the inside, and then we'll have that 1 plus x squared on the outside. Okay, x squared goes into x to the fourth x squared time. So then multiplying out here and putting this so that things line up nicely, x squared times x squared is going to give me an x to the fourth. All right, x squared times 1 will give me an x squared. We'll be subtracting those quantities, so the x to the fourth will fall out. That will leave me with a negative x squared right there. Okay, x squared goes into negative x squared negative 1 times. All right, and going ahead then and multiplying there, then... Uh, negative 1 times the x squared here will give me a negative x squared. Negative 1 times 1 will give me a negative 1 there, and we are subtracting that. So those x squareds are going to fall out, and then I will have a remainder of 1. Okay, now starting up here at the top and going counterclockwise around, I can write my equivalent expression. So x squared minus 1 plus 1 over 1 plus x squared. That's going to be my equivalent expression that is equivalent to this original rational expression. So um, x squared minus 1 plus the remainder over what you divided by. Okay. So then we'll come up here and we will rewrite this integral as the integral of x squared minus 1 plus 1 over 1 plus x squared. Now what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to separate this into two separate individual integrals. So we'll have the integral of an x squared minus 1 dx plus the integral of 1 over 1 plus x squared dx. This is going to be a straightforward integration here, so let's go ahead and integrate there. Adding 1 to that exponent, I'll have an x to the third with a 1 third out in front. And then minus 1 there will integrate to a minus x. Okay, this integral over here, hopefully you have memorized, is arctan, so arctan x, and then plus c. So after you take that initial step of working with that rational expression, doing a little bit of long division, coming up with an equivalent expression for that, and it integrates a whole lot simpler. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends, and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.